Hey everyone, and welcome back to some more the journey down. So, I'm a little stuck still. I need to know where I freaking to. Oh. That won't help me lift the car. Wait, why would I need to lift the car? That won't help. Why do I need to lift the car all of a sudden? Oh my gosh, I don't know what made me think of doing that, but it worked. If you could afford buying a car with fancy wheels like these, then you can afford losing one. Yes! Holy crap! Okay. <laughs> I ended off last episode saying I have no idea what to do with this stuff. But here I am, 30 seconds into the video, and I knew what to do. Oh my gosh. Hey Reynolds, check this out. Right on, brother. I owe you big. Can I take you somewhere? It's on the house. Thanks, man. But I don't really know where to go yet. Don't worry, Jack. I owe you. I'll stick around. You drop by when you're ready to roll. Cool. Nice. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. I knew there had to be something with that stupid car um okay but now we have corn what what am i gonna do with corn oh, we still need like grease and some other stuff for do you want corn man i don't think he's interested does anyone here want corn Hey, want some corn? No, sir. I don't want no corn. Thanks, though. Ah, you are a jerk. You know, I'm just gonna leave the plunger here. I'm gonna flood your whole place. I don't even care. So there's only one radio station in this whole place. Yep. I don't know why. I don't know what this is for, but that's what I chose. Um, 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 um. Let's talk to this. Ah, not crap. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Let's go back out here. Talk to this stupid sailor again. Have you heard of someone named Kaunan Dodo? Look, can't you see I'm busy drinking? Why don't you just crawl back into the dumpster where you belong? Want some corn? I don't think. I don't. I don't. I don't. I. 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 <laughs> I had to try everything. He seems like he's in something important. Oh, maybe if I knock on the door now. What? Why does this guy answer? Okay, I need to figure out what that computer is for as well. You guys want some? I don't. Why not? Navigation book. Oh wait, you know what? Let's look at our map. Where would I need to go? Cemetery, hospital, Enola. One of those. I, I don't. What do I do with this? What do I do with this? Oh crap. Okay. I, I, I have no, absolutely no clue what to do with that computer. It's probably gonna be like that for a little while. Let's see if I can Go to him now. What's up, Reynolds? I'm geared up and ready to go. Rides on me. Uh. I'll see you around. Stay on top, Jack. In Port Arthur, you gotta be street smart. Yeah. But where am I supposed to go? Okay, let's try that 
stupid train station here. What can I do over here? What can I do with this crane? That's one huge crane. The door to the train station is locked. Okay, freaking break Man, it. That door is way too massive to break open. You know what? You're a quitter. You are indeed a quit. Break it with some coin. All right. Ugh. How's it going, fellas? Doing great now with the fire. Thanks, kid. Great fog today, huh, guys? It's bleeding fantastic, kid. Is it always this foggy here? Sort of comes and goes. Most of the time, it's like this. Been a real thick week, though. Thicker than usual for these parts. Yeah, feels like something bad's brewing out there in the big soup, doesn't it? Yeah, it's getting cooler now, though. Might clear up tonight. Might even catch a glimpse of the stars. Better watch out, eh, Mo? Hey, no spookies, okay? Alright, then. <sighs> Sorry about that, I had to let my cat out. Catch a glimpse of the stars, and you know something big is going down tonight. Something big? Someone's gonna bite the bullet, kid. Someone's gonna die? Yeah, and I don't mean no out across turf war. I mean here, on the cold streets of Port Archu. Hey, I told you no spookies. What's the outer cross? Ooh, that might be something we need What's to know. The outer cross? You best just stay away from there, kid. What is it? It's a pirates and thieves nest far out in the soup. You reckon this place is lawless? Take a ship to the outer cross and you get swindled, mugged, killed, and dropped in the mist before you can even set foot on solid ground. Yeah, that place is run by the Susulus and a bunch of other lawless hoodlums. Take our advice and stay away from there, kid. Alright, I got nothing I got out of that. Fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. Who would. Who can I ask? Have you heard of someone called Count Androdo? I think maybe you're mistaking us for somebody else. No, I'm just asking around. Well, you're not getting anywhere with us. We are out of your league. That's so rude. So, so rude. Do we already ask her? Hey, Andiswa. Hey, Buana. Have you heard of someone called Kaunan Dodo? Kaunan Dodo? <laughs> That's a funny name. He's my father. He disappeared from St. Armando years ago. Disappeared? Without a trace. Now I'm trying to find out the truth oh. about what happened to him. I think the answers are here somewhere in Port Archu. Wow. What a mystery. I will keep my eyes and ears open. Later, Andy. See you around. Kaunandodo. Oh, crap, how can I spell that? Kau Nan Do Do Deleted from archives. Just when I thought I was being smart. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. What's up, stick No, I already know. I already know. I already know. I already know. Man. Let's see. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Rubber boat. Beautiful. Can I pop it? I do. Done playing with the rubber boat. Oh my god, what do I do? Who is there left to talk to? You know what? There is this back door. I don't know what to do with. That's the door I was thrown out of after they gave me that beating. Oh. I'm not very interested in going back inside. This is where that gorilla threw me in the dumpster. Yeah, wonderful. I ain't climbing back into... Oh my god. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Man, that's... Um... Let's 
See what I see elephant giraffe monkey snake. So I don't There has to be someone that knows something. Check out my navigational book. That's fine, son. You don't strike me as no mystic. I ain't. I got it from the fellas from the Pico. Well, that's a fine gift, sir. You better sign on to it, you hear? Okay, I think we need to go to the lighthouse for some weird reason. I have no clue why I need to go to the lighthouse, but that's kind of my only choice right now. Oh, we start out so... Oh, wait, actually? Nice place you got here. <laughs> Thanks, son. I try to keep her tidy. What can I do for you? Ever heard of someone named Kaunan Dodo? Kaunan Dodo? Haven't heard that name in a here long, we go. long time. A pilot, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, that's him! Last I saw him, he was working for Barlow. Those two were up to some really shady business, I'll tell you. Count on Dodo worked for Barlow? That can't be right. Quite so. And I'll tell you what else. The two of them led an expedition down to the Underland. The Underland? Oh, yes. You people remember this nowadays. But back then, there were no laws stopping adventurers from trying their luck down there. The expedition was one of the few ventures ever to make it back. What happened to Kaunan Dodo? All I know is that the captain left Port Archu in a hurry. I saw his plane fly off into the mist one morning, and I never saw it again. Some people said he flew back down to the Underland. Others said he left to start a new life in St. Armando. Tell me about the expedition. I can't tell you that much, son. The whole thing was done in secret, you see. But I've worked the lighthouse for over 40 years now. And no vessel comes or leaves port unnoticed by me. I remember seeing them take off in a twin-engine propeller plane. One of those pontoon planes that can land on water, you, you know. That must be Count Andoro's plane! Well, it was a real beauty, wherever it was from. But... When it returned from the Underland a few weeks later, one could tell it had been through some real rough travails. Poor thing barely made it back. Did they bring anything back from the Underland? Rumors said it was loaded with a ton of gold and diamonds when it came back. I wouldn't make much of those rumors, though. Sadly, we'll never know for sure what secrets they uncovered in the Underland. Why not? Soon after the expedition returned to Port Artu, Barlow became the chief of police. And on the same day, the official report about the expedition was made classified. What report? The police suspected the expedition was involved in some kind of dirty business. But the final police report was never revealed to the public. And I'm afraid the secrets were buried together with that police report. Buried or not, I'm going to find out the truth about that expedition. Well... Good luck, son. Won't be easy getting your hands on that police report. I feel like there's going to be a lot of talking, so just bear with me. Um, any idea? Oh! Any idea where I could find that police report? Afraid not, son. You'd have to get real chum-friendly with the powers that be to get hold of that kind of information. Government reports aren't exactly public information around these parts. Nice broadcaster you got up there. Sure is, son. Got a little bit of an extra income spinning tunes and commercials from up there. Landed me a brand new used mattress from Lonnie's it did. It's practically stain free. I'd let you have a lie down, but it's still a little moist. Ew. This here lighthouse is pretty much the ideal radio tower. You can feel just about any frequency from up here. I've got the best broadcasting point in all of Port Artu. Well, except the clock tower, of course. But that thing has been out of commission as far back as I can remember. What's with the clock tower? Oh, it's just kaput, and the mayor won't pay to fix it, that's all. I haven't heard there 
spells tolling for many, many years. Guess it isn't a top priority for the mayor to get it running again. He's too busy spending the city's money down on Main Street to have time with those kinds of things. <laughs> Tell me about the mayor. Oh, he's just another corrupt cog in the machinery of big government. Just another one of the puppets being played by the folks up topside in Saint Armando. So what's the lighthouse good for anyways? Why, all of Port Artu depends on it. It's a proud job I've got. Misting would be impossible without it. And without misting, Port Artu is as doomed as an eel on the cutting board. Misting isn't all that it's good for either. Most trading we do with Saint Armando is done by mist as well, through the locks at Pango Kuwa. They'd never find their way back without the lighthouse. What's Pango Kuwa? That's where the locks are, for traversing up and down from Saint Armando. Anything that goes between the two has to cross Pango Kuwa. Unless you fly, of course. <laughs> but nobody's that mad. Of course, we used to have the trains as well. But the powers that be keep shutting them down for reasons best unasked about. The ships are just about a person's only hope to get in and out of Port Artu these days. Without them, we'd be trapped like pudes in a bucket. <laughs> All right. Oh my God, there's... Okay, one more. What's up with the trains? Oh, they're off limits to the public now, son. Only high government officials use them these days. Why they're requiring enforcing all these regulations and blocking everything off is a mystery to me, son. I figure the less I know about it, the better. What's being blocked off? Well, it's the dangles now. But Port Artu used to be an open port. People were coming and going as they pleased. By ship, plane, and train. Back then, you didn't need permits to travel up and down. A fellow was free to go exploring all they liked. It's like they're trying to hide something, don't you reckon? I'm gonna do this one one more time. Afraid not, son. You'd have to. Any oh crap! You'd have covered. Okay, see you later. All right. Oh well, thanks for the chat. So this guy's been like the biggest help. Feel free to stay around for a while and warm yourself from the fire. Well, he's the nicest guy ever, Morton. Okay, so Morton knows our dad, and that's probably why he's missing. So let's let's get rid of. The, I want to see what all these are as well. Oh, I've got them. They're here on Main Street at Loco Lonnie's Used Mattress Kingdom. Go over here now and grab them while they're still here. What are you waiting for? Go get them now while the offer stands. It's a bargain. I've got them. They're here on Main Street at Loco Lonnie's. Oh, okay. Well then, what can I do with this? Do these numbers matter? What? I don't understand the frequency then. I changed it, but I don't know what for. Uh, what can I use on it? I really don't have anything to use on that right now, which I'm surprised because I have so much crap. But, um, okay. Let's try going to... All over here. Let's try this door one more time. It's Lonnie's. Why doesn't he open? I don't I don't get it. I don't know why he's not opening. But we now have Um What? Oh man. Classified. How do I enter? Enter. Ah, uh, how do I get in? Darn it. Okay, I spelled it wrong that time, but... Ugh! Man, I 
thought I had like two good leads right there. But I'm still missing something. Actually, wait, go back. You ever heard about an expedition to the Underland? <laughs> Have I? Back in the day when diving down into the mist was legal, we had people excitedly going on about it all the time. Once people got to drinking, there was always some fool suggested they go for it. Drop their hard life here in Port Archu and search for treasure in the Underland. <laughs> there ain't nothing but fool's gold there. And those poor fellas that took off? Well... We ain't never heard of or seen them again. It's a dead end, sir. It's a good thing the government finally decided to ban the whole mess altogether. People were disappearing by the bucket load. Was damaging my business, it was. No one ever made it back? Well, I remember hearing about a couple of fellows who returned and claimed they have been there. But ain't it convenient? They failed to bring back a single shred of evidence to prove it. You'd have to be pretty crazy to believe them, then, eh? Any idea where I can get more information about the expedition? Sir, you're gonna have to ask around, because it was a long time ago. You'd have to ask someone who stuck around for a long time. Someone who stuck around for a long to time. Give him hell, sir. Yeah, that's the... Mm. I'm getting nowhere. I'm getting nowhere. Okay, I'm gonna think about this for a while get back to this game tomorrow because I'm I'm pretty stuck um, we got a lot of information but no new items or really much else of that sort but maybe well we're gonna try it let's try this guy one more time what's up Reynolds I'm geared up and ready to go rides on me uh, here we go. do you know anything about expeditions to the underland the Underland? I thought all suckers knew that's just a bunch of fairy dust. I keep it real, you know. Real on the streets. Can you dig it? I'll see you around. Stay on top, Jack. In Port Archu, you gotta... Okay. I think that's a good place to end it. I will come back with a fresh mind on this game. I still really enjoy it. It's awesome. It's definitely difficult. A lot harder than I was imagining. Um... But we're going to finish it all the way through chapter 3 as well. So till then, peace.